The World Health Organization has declared a global public health emergency following an outbreak of the Mpox virus in Africa. It declared that a fast-spreading new variant of the highly infectious disease Mpox is a global health Speed. emergency. The it's situation the constitutes a public health emergency of international concern. On August 14, 2024, the World Health Organization declared Mpox as a public health emergency of international concern or PHEIC. While agencies are monitoring the diseases spread globally, one common aspect of the Mpox outbreak, similar to that of COVID-19, is the consumption of bushmeat. Bushmeat in sub-Saharan Africa cannot just be wished away. It not only provides food security to the region, but is also a cultural practice. So why is Africa an epicenter for such zoonotic spillover and how can it be prevented? According to a 2023 research paper, bushmeat is defined as the meat of terrestrial wild mammals hunted primarily for human consumption in tropical and subtropical regions. The paper's authors mapped bushmeat activities in tropical and subtropical rural areas. They found that the largest areas associated with bushmeat activities worldwide were in Central Africa, Southeast Asia and West Africa. The top 10 countries were Equatorial Guinea, Guinea-Bissau, Liberia, Malawi, Sierra Leone, Laos, Uganda, Vietnam, Ivory Coast and Cameroon. According to the researchers, most countries of Central Africa have a negligible or limited domestic livestock sector. This is the reason why bushmeat is a crucial component of food security there. Moreover, the demand is also increasing as Africa's population rises year on year. The authors of a 2019 academic paper found that the most traded species in Yangambi in the Democratic Republic of the Congo were small monkeys, 38% of the biomass, followed by red dikers, 31%, blue dikers, bush pigs and bush-tailed porcupine. Hunting, preparing and selling bushmeat, commonly known as bushmeat activities, has been associated with high risk for zoonotic pathogen spillover due to contact with infectious animals. Ebola and Mpox spread through contact and exposure to blood, organs and bodily secretions of infected animals. Bushmeat activities provide opportunities for repeated pathogen transmission between animals and humans, leading to outbreaks, epidemics and pandemics. The researchers agreed that neither banning bushmeat nor behavioural change campaigns would make a difference. The 2023 paper's authors cited the importance of preventing deforestation. The paper argues that building roads for logging operations makes it easier to reach remote areas of the forest and transport hunted animals to nearby settlements. This contributes to the spread of bushmeat which can lead to diseases like Ebola. To prevent these diseases, it is crucial to regulate deforestation and logging activities.